Hello, Dean. What were you dreaming about? You get your freak on by watching other people sleep. What do you want? What is this? What does it look like? Is it real? Very. Okay, so what? Angel's got their hands on some DeLoreans? How did I get here? Time is fluid, Dean. It's not easy, but we can bend it on occasion. We'll bend it back. Or tell me what the hell I'm doing here. I told you. You have to stop it. Stop what? Huh? What is there, something nasty after my dad? Oh, come on, what are you allergic to straight answers, you son of a bitch? stop any of it. She still made the deal. She still died in the nursery, didn't she? Don't be too hard on yourself. You couldn't have stopped it. Why do you think I recruited you and Sam in the first place? You recruited us? That wasn't your friend Bobby who called Dean. It wasn't Bobby who told Sam about the seal. It was you. If you want our help, why the hell didn't you just ask? Because whatever I ask, you seem to do the exact opposite. So what now, huh? The people in this town, they're just gonna start dying again? Yes. These are good people. Don't you think you can make a few exceptions? To everything, there is a season. You made an exception for me. You're different. We need to talk. I'm dreaming, aren't I? It's not safe here. Someplace more private. We're private, we're inside my head. Exactly. Someone could be listening. Yes, what's wrong? Meet me here. Go now. Guys, hold up. What were you gonna tell me? I learned my lesson while I was away, Dean. I serve heaven, I don't serve man. And I certainly don't serve you. Don't do that. Hello, Dean. Cares. We've talked about this. Personal space. My apologies. So what, I'm Thelma and you're Louise and we're just gonna hold hands and sail off this cliff together? I need your help. Because you are the only one who'll help me. We're humans. And when humans want something really, really bad, we lie. Please! I gave everything for you. And this is what you give to me. Isn't that suicide? Maybe it is. But then I won't have to watch you fail. Sorry, Dean. I don't have the same faith in you that Sam does. What about Cass? Was he there? Yeah, Cass didn't make it. What exactly does that mean? Something happened to him down there. Things got pretty hairy towards the end, and he just let go. So Cass is dead. You saw him die. 
I saw enough. So, then what, you're not sure? I said I saw enough, Sam. Right. Dean, I'm sorry. Me too. Take a breath. Calm down. Where's the angel? First rule of purgatory, kid. You can't trust nobody. You just asked me to trust you. You see? You're getting it now. First we find the angel. Mm, through the crowd, Chief. Why? Either you're in or you're out. Talk to me. You sure about this? I mean, it's one thing me and Sammy slamming the gates to the pit, but you, you're, you're boarding up heaven. Then you're locking the door behind you. Yeah. I know. You did a lot of damage up there, man. You think they're just gonna let that slide? What do you mean? Do I think they'll kill me? Yeah, they might. So this is it. Cash, you there? Sammy's hurt. He's hurt, uh, he's hurt pretty bad. And, uh, I know you think that I'm pissed at you, okay, but I don't care that the angels fell. So whatever you did or didn't do, it doesn't matter. Okay, we'll work it out. Please, man, I need you here. Cass, what the hell's going on? Metatron tricked me. It wasn't angel trials, it was a spell. I wanted you to know that. Okay, well, that's great, but we got ourselves a problem. What's wrong? Sam, he's, um, they say he's dying. What happened? I don't know, I mean, at first he was okay, and then he wasn't, and I, have you heard my prayers? I've been praying to you all night. Dean, Metatron, he, he took my grace. What? Don't worry about me, what are you doing for Sam? Uh, everything I can. I, there's actually another angel in there working on him right now. What other angel? Um, his name is Ezekiel. He's cool. I mean, I think he is. Ezekiel. Yes. He's a good soldier. He should be able to help until I get there. Well, no, 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 no. Hey, that's not an option. Might be a few days, but... Hey, Cass, listen to me. There are angels out there, okay? And they, they're looking for you, and they're pissed. Not all of them, Dean. Some are just looking for direction. Some are just lost. What are you talking about? I've met one. I think I can help her, Dean. No, Cass. I know you want to help, okay? I do, but helping angels is what got you in trouble in the first place. Now I'm begging you for once, look out for yourself. Until we figure out what the hell is going on, trust nobody. And do what? Just abandon them all? Damn it, Cass. You hearing yourself? There's a war on, and it's on you. There's thousands of them out there. You said you lost your grace, right? That means you're human. That means you bleed, and you eat, and you sleep, and all the things you never had to worry about before. I'm fine, Dean. Whoa. What's going on? I think we got more company. Well, get your ass to the bunker. Alone. You hear me? Dean. Go, Cass. Dean. Obviously, you and Gadriel managed to turn a few dead-enders against me. Gadriel is dead. Ah. Oh. So Gadriel bites the dust. And the Angel Tablet, arguably the most powerful instrument in the history of the universe, is in pieces and for what again? Oh, that's right. To save Dean Winchester. That was your goal, right? I mean, you draped yourself in the flag of heaven, but ultimately, it was all about saving one human, right? 
Well, guess what? He's dead, too. And you're sitting in my chair. Where the hell are you, Cass? Oh, I'm... I'm okay. You don't sound okay. Me and I am fine. And besides what I have, you can't help me. What do you mean, what you have? Just... Please tell Sam. Rowena escaped with the Book of the Damned and the Codex. Okay, forget Rowena. Where are you? Now, you tell me. The mark. Oh, really? You worried about me after everything that I've... Dean, is it gone? Yes, I'm good. I mean, I'm... I'm not great. Thanks, two of us. This is good news. Hey, Cass. Sam. Okay, your turn. Talk to us about the darkness. Why would I talk about the darkness? Because it's free. No, that can't be. Removing the mark opened some kind of lock. Dean saw her. The darkness is a woman? Well, that's what we're asking you. We were hoping you could tell us what kind of DEFCON screwed we are. Cass? Sam, Dean, goodbye. It may be some time before we see one another again. Wait, Cass. Cass!